It's a problem we are really not used to on October 21st, but a problem we are all dealing with today. Yesterday's storm left many of us scrambling to find our winter cleanup gear. As Susan Elizabeth Littlefield shows us, even those who specialize in snow removal were caught off guard. This is what Greg Fucci does. Well, that was heavy. It's just that this is not usually when he does it. I was expecting to be doing fall cleanups through the whole entire month, and last 24 hours I had to completely disassemble my fall cleanup box and make sure the plow was still already and working. Luckily for the owner of this rich filled home, it is still working. He had to switch gears too. I was trying to get somebody to actually rake up all the leaves, and that was. Uh, not happening. It was hard to find somebody, and before I knew it, it's snowing. So I'm like, okay, well, I guess I'm just moving to a snow plow. So he used the app Plows and Mows, which calls snow contractors like Greg on demand. The company says they have dispatched more than 1,500 calls in the Twin Cities over the past 24 hours. No one was really prepared for this whatsoever, and then for us as contractors, it's nice to get the extra work. Speaking of work, Greg says if snow stays on the ground, it's okay to just leave the leaves until spring. But if things do warm up, he says it's best to go ahead and get those leaves out of the way. I'll have to do something in the spring, but that's six months from now. For now, it's a game of wait and see. Will more leaves or more snow fall first? In Richfield, Susan Elizabeth Littlefield, WCCO 4 News.